to nine. Grace Kim on the tee. What a shot that is. Look at that curve. That ball curved one foot to the left. Just the angle of the green, the, the angle of the tee shot already can mess with the player. Grace Kim for a two at nine. She played a little too far left. Missed it on the high side, so boy, that's an opportunity wasted in a tee shot like that at this par three. She's hanging tough. She's just two shots behind. She said he, she is so strong throughout her entire bag. She hits everything well. The one thing that Grace feels like, oh, nice putt. Nice. The one thing that Grace feels like she needs to do is get a little bit stronger. Here's Grace Kim now. It'd be interesting to see how she plays this. Very good. Grace Kim now, you remember, put her shot behind the hole here at 11. This for birdie. Didn't matter. That's a beautiful stroke there. Now tied for the lead, Grace Kim. She has 170 yards. She is going with a six iron. Wind's still helping a little bit. Wow, that was great. Two-time All-American ASU, won a national title, gets her card, and then has to go back to Epson Tour for a year. So, fascinating to me. It just shows you that all, all aspects of the game are on display here this week. I think she was top five in putts and greens regulation, so that's a nice little balance. Not going to like that one, though. Lost her balance a little bit, it looked like. It's a pull to the left and into the bunker. Where Grace Kim, you'll remember, drove it in the bunker. It looks to be sitting down just a little. It's on the upslope. The lip is a factor. All in all, a pretty hard shot that sounded like a DC strike. Just short. Hard to get the ball all the way back to the hole from that position. It's now going to be a little chip and run up the green. Very slow. She almost got it. 13. Trying to stay in that share of the lead, and she did it. Beautiful putt there. No stress, no signs of stress. The co-leader, Grace Kim. This is a really difficult tee shot. Crosswind, there's a bunker you have to watch out for on the right. Oh, that one disappeared from our view. This is a great break. Now she can fire at this hole. I mean, that bunker, we've already seen Christina come up short of the green. That was a break of the tournament, in my opinion. And, and sometimes, I mean, we, that's what it can take. I mean, it doesn't look like she's capitalized on it too much there, but do you have a sense for her short game, Angela, having been out there watching her? Yeah, that was the first one that it looked like she, but you know, it took her longer to make a decision on the shot. In the last four holes, a little bit of trouble here. Got up and down on the last hole. Let's kind of see how she reacts to this. First drop shot of the day. Grace Kim on the tee here at the shortish par three, uphill shot all the way. She has 125. You still have to kind of play this out to the right. The green's still firm. It's going to be a fourth shot of the par four. First to 15. It's the second shot at the par three for Kim. Oh, she got that a good roll, too. Yeah, she did. Over 15, Grace Kim with a four footer for a par. Got it. Solid stroke there. Foul her up at all. Right here is a good look at what the players see on the tee at 16. Grace Kim. You like right or left? I apologize, Grant. Yes, she has 136. Great angle, but the wind is moving left to right. 
Grant, she hasn't hit a game since number 12. She needs a good shot here. That was clever. That was pretty special. Very special. Really good putt on the par three, 15 for par. Great save here. Nice to see her kind of pull it back together in this round. Second shot for Grace Kim at 17. Playing a little bit easier today. But not for Grace Kim right about now. I don't know now, if because now she's missed this one left. We've seen her miss the last two right. That was a wonderful bunker shot. As you would expect, comes up just a little bit short. It's a generous nine feet. <laughs> Wow, that, she is going to look back and remember. Well, this has been the easiest hole all week. I'd, I'd love a reachable par five, last hole of the day. It looks like she's headed into the bunker. Third shot now for Grace Kim. Grant, she could have taken a drop, I confirm with the official. She had 90 yards to the front and 105 to the flag. Chose not to take a drop. Pull your thoughts together and restart and make a good putt. Oh, wow. Yep. And and the, it's such a bunch leaderboard. Yeah. You know, she's still, you know, any, anything can happen still tomorrow for Grace. 